Hey yo, it's -a me, Mar. Welcome back to Firewatch. Um, it's been a couple days since I've played, and I'm trying to remember what's happened. Last time we had to tell some teenagers to stop making fireworks, burning down the whole forest. Then there was a questionable mystery man that shined his light, or a woman, we don't know yet, haven't figured it out. And then there was somebody broke in, so we have like a hole in the window, and we're currently trying to call and report the incident, but the phone lines are down. So now they're telling me I have to go and check on these phone lines. See, maybe, apparently I can't fix them, but I'm going to go look and see what's wrong. That's where we're at. Okay. I was, I was also reading more about the game and apparently there's, it's like, there's like a mystery, which I didn't know. And then there's like something more than just me escaping my problems. So now I'm like, ooh, ooh, am I going to get attacked by a bear? And by bear, I mean a big burly man. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> That'd be funny. He's just like, I'm gay now. And there's a bear after me. Actual bear. Oh, anyways, I guess things that you save, they end up in here. So like we, we took the fireworks and we took the whiskey. That's cool. Oh, I, I made the picture crooked. Sorry. Oh, you can actually read it. That's cool. Huh. Interesting. Can I, can I not pick it up? No, they're just like, oh yeah, you can like read it if you really tried hard enough. <clears throat> Sleep is going to be a real problem. Without making this a list of all that's happening all the time for Henry from the future, this was the first night your tower got turned over and your sheets were gone. Going to have to figure that out today because last night wasn't good. I'm freezing. I was 100% sure I wouldn't have any Jules dreams out here since I was sleeping in a new place and everything, but sure enough. During the 30 minutes I fell asleep around 5 a.m., there, there we were, back on the beach in Melbourne. There's that moment where I know it's coming, where I know the water is going to come up and up and up, and I think I'm going to spew or my, my heart's going to stop or something, but this time I woke up before anything happened. Maybe that's progress. I had my fingers crossed that I would just be dreaming about squirrels and mountains and trees and shit, but what are you going to do? What are you going to do? All right, he having... Recurring nightmares. Great. What's this? I was like, what is this paper? Hey, there's a like, map in my what? tower that I'm pretty sure is not USGS regulation. Um, unless I've unknowingly is D &D? been assigned to work in two orcs and the lake <laughs> to the east is made of acid. Uh, that sounds erroneous. Oh, treasure chest. Looks like the previous resident was into fantasy. There's some... There's some I wonder if I can get are these like actual like like what weapons cash weapons cash are these the actual like supply thing supply cases out here like little X marks that say treasure also why is Death Mountain there's a guy just like wee oh that probably means he can climb it it's like a place to climb oh I thought it was a I thought his hands were like wee <laughs> yeah climb check okay wow let me just read the legend <laughs> climb check required. <laughs> I wonder if I can get these, because I know I got that one. I know we got that one, but I, I missed the lake one, and this one I feel like might be reachable. Hmm, maybe we'll check that out. It looks pretty close. We're gonna put this. I want to keep this. This is nice. Uh, there you go. That safekeeping. All right. Anything else I can talk to uh, Delilah about? Old Scottish oil soap. What? What this? Paperwork? We love paperwork. Alright, whatever. Alright. We're going. What's happening? We're heading out. Flip the lights. Oh, turn off the light switch. We don't have to waste energy out here. We only have a generator and some propane tanks. Ah. The great outdoors. Let's see. Ooh. Come on. Do a little jog. No, you just woke up. Can I say hi? You wake up pretty early then, huh? As soon as the sun comes up. Forest Service really frowns on us putting up curtains for some reason. Yeah. Oh, wait, uh, uh. I covered my uh, I just covered my head with my pillow. Seems to do the trick. <laughs> wow. The forest could never burn down on your watch. <laughs> uh, hey, I can see your tower. Suppose that means you can see me. Mm. Yeah, well enough. <laughs> can you see the communication wires from where you are? I can see the poles, but I have no idea if the wire is in good shape or not. They run a good distance up to a spot called Beartooth Point. Mm -hmm. You just need to walk along them all the way up there and make sure everything's in ship shape. Okay. 
Alright, let me see. Kinda wanna grab this one. I don't know if I can also grab that one. I don't know why I like just collecting things before. I, I don't wanna be extra overly prepared. I don't know if that's the kind of game this is or if this is just extra like lore or something, but it looks pretty close. We're gonna head that way. It's uh south. South. This looks south. Yeah. This looks like a path. It should be fine. It'll be fine. Yeah. Oh. I think this is a room. Yeah, this looks like a path. Yeah, that's a path. I get like, oh. Kind of misty, kind of... Kind of creepy. Uh, it's actually pretty damn cold out here. Roger that. Warms up fast. The mornings are cold in Boulder though, right? Yeah, they are. What did you get up to down there? I mean, what what's life like? Uh, uh we'll talk about uh, my dog. Uh, you know, um, I don't know. I used to just spend a lot of time with our dog, Bucket. Aw, that's a good name. Bucket. He was a good dog. What type? A beagle. We got him from the pound. Aww. That's great. Hey, can you hold on a sec? But uh, sure. Just gonna keep hiking and hoping it warms up. Heyo. I don't think so. Why, have you? Okay, good. Huh? No, I don't think he has any idea. We're just gonna listen. I'm absolutely sure. Would you? Alright, I'll let you know if anything changes in that regard. Okay. Hey, sorry about that. Anyway, Bucket's a cute name. What? You, um, what was you that about? Him with someone? I'm gonna just I'm gonna pretend we didn't hear nothing. I need to know <sighs> more be before I confront her. Julia. Oh, like, like your wife, or like she's taken half my stuff, wife. Oh, my wife. But you're here. Yeah. Uh, everything's fine. Everything's fine. Just, you know. We're Taking some time apart, getting some fresh air. Okay. A little change. Yeah. All right. Well, we can just leave it at that. Thanks. Yeah, we're, we're gonna be vague. You're gonna be vague. I can jump with spacebar. What? I've been trying to jump. Oh. Like this. No, no, no. no. We're just gonna. I'm gonna walk. What do you mean jump? The heck? I got boots on. Boots with the fur. Hey, look. Except like a she. One, two, three, four. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, we got the copy down the map. All right. Oh, it's a lending library. Okay. It's a note saying. It's the note. Hey, who are these guys, Ron and Dave? They're leaving notes for each other in the boxes. Mm -hmm. Is there any chance one of them was that guy I saw in the canyon? You know, the guy with the flat. Oops. Flashlight. My bad. No, they're both rangers. They're not out here this season. I didn't really know him that well, but I always assumed the only thing Ron cared about was chasing tail and getting loaded. Oh. It's somehow comforting oh. to know that he was able to keep up a correspondence with someone who wasn't going to send him a topless Polaroid. Oh, okay. <clears throat> Ron. Really wish the powers that be could issue us radios that didn't suck ass. <laughs> Most of the time I'd prefer to keep things pen to paper, but every once in a while it'd be nice to get a hold of you right away. My sister keeps leaving me messages at the main office, but I don't think she gets that I took the job, so I wouldn't have to deal with her or mom. I've been sitting at the spot for a while now, think about what to say to her, but I'm a quarter way through a bottle of fives instead. Miss you, Dave. Right, Dave. He says he misses you. Well, we got some books. We got some toilet paper. We got pine cone. I think that's it. There's nothing else in there. Alright, well. Book time. Well, do I have to like look at the books or anything? No. Okay, I thought I'd be able to like open it or something with this one. One chance to. D oh, it's a gun, but in the shape of a one. That's clever. Oh, let me close the cash. Maybe I'll get the other one by the lake. Maybe. 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 Yeah, why not? We're here. We're we're collecting things so that we're up to date. And ready for anything that comes our way. I take it you fell oh. prey to the Forest Service's big recruiting effort when it comes to, you know, how the hell you ended up out here. Uh. I saw the job in the paper and figured, you know, what the heck. What the heck? I've got.
got no ties and no life. Better go spend what's left of it in utter loneliness. <laughs> Something like that? Now, thanks to last summer, the bump in Forest Service budget actually allowed for us to oh, advertise pretty. for the job. Glad it worked. What happened last summer that accounted for this um, windfall? Money. Jeez. I mean, the federal government almost let Yellowstone National Park burn to the ground? Ring a bell? Uh. Oh my god. Yellowstone oh, is oh, like, what, oh 15 gosh. miles away. Why would they do that? Well, the short story is that for 60 years, we got very good at not letting forest fires happen. And then about oh my 15 gosh. years ago, they decided that forest fires in wilderness areas like Yellowstone should be left to burn. So that's what they did. I can't believe you didn't hear about this. There were reports that the entire park was gone. Dan Rather telling the country that President Reagan didn't care on the nightly news. I and mean, what the hell's he going to do? Smoke jump in and well, snuff one out for the Gipper? So what should they have done? I don't even know. By the time the Yellowstone folks realized the little fires weren't going to burn themselves out, a hundred thousand acres were gone. That's crazy. It's Yellowstone, you know? People don't want to touch it. But we touch it every single day. But hey, I got a 30 cents an hour raise because we can't have another fiasco. Ooh, a raise. The goddamn park can burn down again. Hmm. Also, what is this? Ooh, that wind last night actually tore up some trees near my tower. I know, right? Ugh, it's out of this world. Now, imagine we had a big fire no. burning. Yeah. Jesus. It's something else. I've seen a still evening kick up 45 mile an hour winds in no time. If that happens this summer, you'll really be in for it. Alright. Let's see. Oh dang, this feels like this feels like a totally different way. I feel so confused. Oh thanks for the save point. Is it gonna be a boss battle? We already went this way though. Alright, I need to get back to the lake. But wait. Oh no wait, I don't have a rope though. Am I still able to go this way? Oh no. I don't know. I don't know. Was it Did... was this here before? Hey, there's a tree out here that's been ripped to hell. And? Don't you think that's, you know, like, uh, disconcerting? Henry, there are 500-pound grizzly bears out here. They sharpen their claws on trees. 500? We don't have grizzlies in Colorado. People killed them a long time ago. Well, in the thoroughfare, they hunt people, they kill people, they bury their bodies, and then come back weeks later to eat them because they prefer rotten meat. Oh. People just disappear. Don't you think that's disconcerting? <laughs> no, Henry, that's life. Christ, lady. All right. Damn. Jeez. Okay. Let's see. Attach rope to hook. I don't think I have a rope. I'm at the shale slide. I, I can't climb down from here without a rope. Um, you shouldn't need a rope where you're headed. The climb through the canyon has its dangerous bits, but you should be able to do it without gear. Oh. Which way is the canyon again? <laughs> it's just north of your tower. Oh. Oops. What am I looking at here? My tower which way is that from the shale slide oh that's easy it's a straight shot eastward thanks oh that's cool they tell you if you're lost all right well you can't go that way that's for sure hmm wait probably gonna go through the i gotta go through the cave oh my gosh <laughs> we're just gonna hop skip and leap over to the cave real quick goodbye what the Oh. Wait. What's this way? There's really no way past some of this underbrush that's grown over the trail. See, the thornier a trail is, the less inclined a ranger is to want to deal with it. They'll just hike or take their horse a different way. I guess I need a machete. A machete. Yeah. Okay, we're back at the tower. Very good, very clean, very nice. Now where am I actually going? To the right, to the right, to the right. Oh, look at the beautiful sunrise. Look at the mountain peaks. That's, it's so pretty out here. They, oh, wow, there's actually another fallen tree here. Oh, that's cool. Okay, there's like another one. Because I definitely went the other way. It's cool that they have like extra opportunities to see. Um, 
the landscape changing and telling Delilah about it. What's this way? Is this another? Oh, ah, uh, 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 see? Nope. Okay, we'll go back. I went. That was where I came from, I think. So we'll just take the path down. Let's see. We are sprinting today. We know what we're doing. We're professionals now. Look at him go. Wait. Wait, how did I go the wrong way? Oh my gosh. What the heck? This is why I always have to constantly be looking at my compass because I just be going the wrong freaking way. The whole time. Oh my gosh. Is it this way? Is this the way? No! Oh my. What's that? Why is that? Where am I going and why are things- I'm scared. This looks like stuff is going to fall when they have like a little crumbly crumble coming around here. I don't like that. Nope, don't like that at all. Where am I? This is not the right way. What? What is happening? Where am I going? This isn't it. This is definitely incorrect. Where am I? Medicine wheel? I guess we're checking out the medicine wheel. Oh, okay. We're here. Hello, signs. Uh, Ruby River. Ruby River. I didn't mean to go this way. I was actually trying to continue the story, but here we are checking out the medicine wheel. Yeah. With the mountains popping in. Is this the medicine wheel? We're gonna find like a bear or something out here? Medicine wheel. Medicine. Oh. Oh. Wow, there's an old, um, I think it's called a medicine wheel out here. Hmm. Yeah, it was made by Crow American Indians hundreds of years ago. Oh. There are lots of small ones. Um, have you ever been to Medicine Wheel Monument over in the Bighorns? The Bighorns. I sure haven't. Well, it's worth a three hour detour on the way home in August. Uh, neat. I'll keep it in mind. Three hours? Huh. Well, we're at the Medicine Wheel. Whatever that means. So, I'm at the Medicine Wheel. So, you're near your lookout. Yeah, sure. I'm just wandering around in the forest and I haven't seen one of the Red Eagle cans for miles. Uh, that's a tough one. Why don't you try getting out of the woods so you can get a better view? Find a vista or a lookout point. Okay, I'll try that. Are we just exploring now? Like, what's over here? Nothing? A dead end? Okay. That looks like something for later. So, if I'm at the medicine wheel, am I getting close to that wire? Uh, I know. no. You're off track. The easiest thing to do would be to head back to your tower, then north through the canyon. Feel free to find it's a landmark answer. and call me from there if you're still lost. This is- I like how they have that line that they had to record, like, if you're on this mission and you decide to explore, we have something for you. What was that? Something like- Okay, let's uh, really actually go back the right way. Please. Oh my gosh, I made a circle again. <laughs> Not the tree. <laughs> oh my goodness. How does this happen to me? Why am I so bad at this? I purposely did not mean to do this. I was actually trying to go the right way. I don't know how this happened. We're, I'm sorry. We're, we're trying. We are trying today. Apparently not hard enough, but it's a try. We are attempting stupid- I've seen you like eight times now. Oh my gosh. And here I am thinking I'm gonna get through this more efficiently. <laughs> Somehow gets lost anyways. Alright. Back at the tower again. <laughs> Holy crap, we're gonna get nothing done today. I already feel it. Let's go. Good morning, sunrise. We're not gonna go straight for the sun, I think. We're gonna go and have the compass out. I was reading the map wrong. We're, no, I know I wasn't. We're supposed to go a north. This way. There we go. A north. Was I just not looking at it right? Northeast. Yes. Yeah. Oh, outhouse. Okay, this is definitely more north northy. Look, another tree. Let's see. Uh, 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 this one. Uh, I feel like I'm gonna be murdered when I'm in the outhouse. Oh, baby ball. Feeling a little exposed, are we? Hey, no man in the history of the world has felt tough with his pants around his ankles. 
Well, be strong. You can always call if you're having trouble. All right, thank you. Sure, I'll do that. Thanks, appreciate that. All right, so this is definitely more correct. There we go. All right, all right, we're we're back on track. We gotta go down, 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 down. Where is the broken sign that I broke? It should be. Is this the right way? Is this the right way? Yes. Okay. This is correct. We're going the right way. We're going down, down, down to the caves. Wee! I. Pff, this ain't realistic at all. I would snap my knee and my neck I'm trying to do that in real life. Let's go. Whoop! Ah! What? You mean you're telling me that he's able to just jump down? Rocky cliff, but not slide down smooth cliff. All right. Okay. All right. Thank you. Thank you, Game Logic. Appreciate that. We are coming down the mountain. Yes, we are. We are hopping down the mountain. Yes, we are. Hop a bit up. Up, 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 up. We got. We got rocks and trees and twigs and bees. We got butterflies and things I want to see. Where is the cave? Where is the cave? Cave. Wow, this one's pretty hidden, honestly. <laughs> Holy crap. Wee! Oh, I got flashlight. I forgot. It's. Oh, it's kind of spooky. Um, it's locked. Yeah, we don't have that yet. We don't have a key. No key for me. All right. So. So. Um. So you see, there's that. And I, I mean, I've already wasted a lot of time. We're going to just... Nope, we're not going to get sidetracked. We'll do that later. There's going to be time, I'm sure. There's got to be. We'll, we'll probably head that way. Oh, wait. What's this? Gap and brush. Oh. Okay. Nice. Um, We love having decisions that lead to the same direction. All right. Whoa. That looks like... Oh. A rope point. Can I throw a rope up there? Well, I don't have a rope right now, so never mind. Can he- will he say something? Nope. Alright, we're just gonna walk. We're going. We're walking. It's very foggy. He would've probably said the fog comment here if I had just gone the right way. <laughs> Let's see. It'd really be foggy though. What time is it in game? I don't remember what they said. It's over here. A whole lot of nothing? This is really pretty. Honestly, they really did a good job with making the trail look like a real trail. I love that. Oh, I see the thing. I see the. We're, we're getting here. Uh, I can see the wire. This looks like progress. It looks like it's in good shape. Let's go. Here. We'll follow it up to the top of the trail if you can. You can head back as soon as you give me the all clear. Got it. All right. Also, I like, look at this. Look at nature. Look at Mr. Prickle. Prickle Dickle. What are you saying? Mar. What's that? We got sign. Beartooth Point. Thoroughfare Lookout. Let's see, where am I? Where am I? Okay, there's like an oh there's like a clearing over here and I saw a, a building. Some sort of structure. What is that? What are you? Is this an outhouse? Oh it is. Uh, hey, I found a structure that might have been an outhouse once, I think. Whoa, uh, you don't need my permission to go to the bathroom, <laughs> but, you know, use abandoned shitters at your own peril. I mean, uh, I'm in the right area? <laughs> yeah, the wire runs quite a ways north. Just follow it up to the point that I mentioned. Okay. This outhouse oh, you can is say in the it middle again. of nowhere. Well, I hate to tell you, but everything out here is in the middle of nowhere. Uh, you know what she's I mean? Spicy. Am I on the right track? Just keep following the wire to the top of the ridge, and then you can head back. Okay, damn. And there's this note in here. I found an old notepad of, uh, I guess, songs. Oh, Someone was, was this writing song? a song called Old Shoshone. Old Shoshone, where the sky is blue and the teens are nude. <laughs> <laughs> it's, uh, yeah, it's just like that, except about ten times more depressing. <laughs> Old Shoshone, Winthrop Carter, Hawks Rest. Hmm, I'm headed off to Old Shoshone. Where the, do I have to sing this? I don't know the lyrics. I'm headed off to Old Shoshone, where the birds and the bees won't know me. Where men in the war don't exist no more. 
Oh, wait. Hold on. <laughs> there ain't no gals who keep no score. Good recovery, Mar. I'm taking it off for the woods to a place where there ain't no shoes. Brown. Don't need no books, I'll ponder the ponderosas. Don't need no lady, I'll marry the merry bosas. Can't waste no time in getting there. I'll do 80 down, 80 without a prayer. <laughs> Don't need no gal, I'll spruce up for the spruces. Don't need no pal, I'll change my mood for the mooses. <laughs> If you're wondering where's my Aspen, it's been cavorting with the Aspens. We got, we got vocabulary. We got it. Thesaurus. What are we doing? Don't need no grass. I'll get altered among the alders. Don't need no mess. I'll grovel before the boulders. I'm headed off to Old Shoshone where the elk and the owls won't know me. Where they ain't no judges to whom I gotta plea. Because I, I can't. <laughs> Because I can be me in old Shoshone. And the crowd goes wild. I don't know if I'm going to keep that whole thing in there, but we'll, we'll see. We'll see how we go. I love that song. It was great. Good job, Mar. <laughs> Alright, we'll keep that for later. When we get back to civilization, we'll uh we'll go record it in the studio real quick. <laughs> Alright. Um um uh, uh buttons. What What is that? It's not on the map. What is that? Am I gonna get murdered? This is a horror. I didn't agree to the horror game. Uh anything I should know about the cabin at the top of this hill? Hello. Okay then. Oh no, I, I, I didn't agree to a murder mystery horror game, but we're gonna find out. I love how she's like, she's like, oh, I heard you. You're gonna find out yourself. Oh. Hey, um, I'm just gonna look at this box real quick. Why does it look weird? Hello? Hey, yo, let's get a shit out of me. I clicked it to open it and it pushed me backwards. I didn't even do anything. Like, look, look, I'm gonna click it. And it's pushing me backwards. I have no idea. Is this a glitch? This is freaking me out. Why can't I open this? Why can't I? Watch, I click. Why? Why? Is this broken? Am I not allowed to be here? I'm scared. This is giving me the heebie-jeebies. Oh, I got goosebumps. I'm scared. What is in this? What's in the cabin? What's in the cabin? Hello? Will I fall to my death? I'm gonna save. No, I don't know if, if there's like death in this game. I'm gonna save. If you could, if you could feel my heartbeat right now, I am nervous. Um, I don't play horror games for a reason. This place looked like it burnt down. Ruined firefinder. So trash. We got cigarette boxes. Oh, I have like a nervous sweat going on right now. Can I fall to my death? Nope. Okay. What about down the steps? Is there a dead body? I'm scared. Uh, hello? That the guitar. Oh no. It was the old Shoshone. The old Shoshone singer. We got more cigarettes. We got propane. Okay. Ooh, all right, we got a stove. I guess something's hidden in here. Why do you have to pull it open so aggressively? Oh my goodness. He's like, oh yeah. We got a cupboard. Got. Ooh, my favorite. We got trees. Hell yeah, brother. <laughs> my tree kink. Let's go. Alright, okay. So it seems like we're fine, right? I didn't see. Nothing was. Just those. This is pretty. Can I jump there? No. Can I jump up? Nope. I guess it was just for dramatic effect. Can't even open this anymore. Alright, well. Seems safe to me. Is this? Nope, that, I thought that was blood. I didn't want... They in the cabin and they burnt to a crisp. Hey Delilah, hey, hey, can you like fill me in on what this old cabin's about? Because I am creeped out. 
And for some reason the game's not letting me open this supply cache. A44. Can I open this way? Was it just glitched? This is a weird looking one too. Okay. Korea veteran. Huh. Found an old hat from a Korean war vet. You'd be surprised how many former service members take this gig. Well, makes sense. I imagine if you've been through war, you probably can't get enough silence. Hmm. Also, like, why didn't you say nothing about me saying something about the old cabin? Ma'am, but you'll talk about this old hat. Put on. I can put it on? Oh, yeah. I now have hat on. I don't know if that'll bite me in the ass later or whatever, but we'll see. Maybe it'll save me. Ma'am, why didn't you say nothing about me exploring the creepy old cavern? And why was the game glitching when I touched the box and it forced me to run backwards like I was possessed by a spirit? I didn't like that. Ugh, that gave me goosebumps. Did not like it. No bueno. We're gonna go continue the mission. Following the yellow brick road. Oh no, we're following this. Is that you? Oh, that's you. Hello. Let me talk to you. What? It says I can talk to you. Okay, whatever. All right. Fine. Utility pole. Hello? So we really can't reach anyone any other way than these wires? What else do you suggest? Smoke signals? Just seems dangerous. Well, if Smoke they don't signals? hear from me for a few days, they'll send someone out. But I'd rather it not come to that. Okay, well, whatever. Why don't you, you have the guy you were talking to quietly? Hawks rest. Okay. All right. Um, this looks like mountains I can't cross, so probably just go straight. We shall go straight. Should, it says there's a little supply box out here. There it is. I see you. What's up? Um, get in the treasure. Get in the treasure. Bing, bong, bong, bing, bong, bong. What? Is that a flower? It's a flower! Oh, so pretty. Kind of reminds me of Gris, actually. Or Gris. Gris. Grease is grease. The colors back in the world. Oh, a turtle. Whoa! I uh, I found a turtle. Maybe it's a, a tortoise. Why is it's it a thing with a shell? Why is it in the rock? Well, isn't that something? It's actually pretty cute. Are you glitching? Well, Henry, if you decide you wanted to keep you company, nobody will mind. Now what do I call Adopt? it? Adopt. Looks like a uh, hmm. Oh, this ought to be good. <laughs> Turt Reynolds. Turt Reynolds. <laughs> well, now I can't wait to see him. The mustache is impressive. <laughs> you tell him I love Cannonball Run. Oh my gosh. I only know the name Kurt Reynolds. Or, yeah, Kurt, Kurt Reynolds. I only know the name Kurt Reynolds because, uh, oh, I'm just gonna keep him? Because I watch Archer. Archer's like one of my favorite shows. I just don't have Hulu anymore, so now I can't watch it. It's like my comfort show. Oh, lord, lord, lord. Time to open this. With my turtle in pocket and my North Korean War veteran- North Korean? And my Korean War hat on my head. Don't mind me with my turtle and Korean War veteran hat. Oh my gosh. Wait. Mmm, trees. Yes, this is for me. Take the note. Oh, this one looks serious. <clears throat> Dave. Hey yo. Is it me? Is Dave me? Hey yo. It's me, Dave. I got your note about needing to talk. Ooh, it sounds serious. Sorry I didn't track you down. Been looking for you all day. Figured you'd be out near the canyon helping those grad students, but I guess not. I don't even know how I could really help anyway. We're co-workers, you know. Amigos. Professionalis. If you need someone to throw a case back with and go time traveling, Ron's your guy. But I'm not great with the life stuff. You get it? Later. Ron. 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 Oh, so I'm Ron. Hey yo, it's me, Ron, and I'm not good at life stuff. Thanks. Oh, we got little pretty flowers. Got some wood, pine cone. A board? Wait. Ooh, it's a board. Weep. What is this? Six feet down under? This is just a. What? It's a book. For what? Well, you can be. You can be hidden there all you want. Goodbye. All right, let's see what are we doing. 
Gotta oh, gotta go up there. Uh, yeah, okay, the wire's down here. Oh, really? shoot, it's like... Awesome. Good find. It's like, I don't know, a mile and a half east of me. You just follow the trail up the hill, you can't miss it. I'll go see what the damage is. Okay. Time to inspect the wire, even though I'm not a certified electrician. It's fine. We got plot armor. Oop. I beat up a man 20 years ago. I can handle a broken wire. Let's do this. Oh, I can just jump down. Yeah, I love it. Oh, my flashlight's on. Let me just waste the battery. Can I jump down? Let me jump down 50 feet. Oh, oh, that got me. Oh, I'm a little scared of heights. So that got me all like, whoa, I don't want to jump. I'm scared. I wouldn't know what to do. I'd just be like, well, I'm stuck here now. Thanks. Want to send me an airdrop? Ooh, ooh, more flowers. Look at the pretty red flowers. Look at you. So, <laughs> look at you. Oh, it's so pretty. Oh, beer can. Oop. Guess what? What is it? There's a bunch of empty cans up here. Same as before. Mm -hmm. Yep. These fucking kids. Can these girls be? How can these girls be so stupid? <laughs> Trust me, I never underestimate the stupidity of a drunk teenager. Jeez. Also, I never underestimate the balls of a drunk young woman, having been one. Uh, long drop. Oof. Bleh. 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 I get so nervous when I have to look down. Like whenever I go hiking, I stay as far away as I can from the edge because one little slip up and oof, you you may or may not die, and if you do survive. You're gonna be suffering because uh, it's not gonna be instant death. It's definitely a sufferer, or like you get injured and then you can't you can't find safety and you get cold and then you're hungry or some animal gets you. And then, no, I don't play. I don't play games. We go hike. We follow the trail. We don't veer off. No, 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 no. Then we just clean up this mess. You nasties. Clean up. Clean up. On your panties? Who in their right mind would write on their panties? Wasting a pair of panties just to say, oh, you you my Shut up. Hey, so the wire no is definitely way. down out here. I just found it. Yeah, the thing is, it doesn't look like the wind. It looks like it was cut deliberately. Hmm. I knew it. The moment you said you found their trash. Oh, these idiots are going to pay. These Do they idiots. realize this is how people die? I mean, what if something happened to one of my lookouts while this was going on? And God forbid there's an actual fire burning out of control. What do you want to do? <laughs> I want you to go find them. Ooh. And then what? I... I haven't thought that far ahead. That's not true. Everything <laughs> that comes to mind is illegal. Illegal. Mm. Let's hear it. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah? Hey, I came out here for a breath of fresh air and some adventure. Well, we're going for some adventure. I think I want you to just find them and scare the hell out of them. Oh. Yeah, I'd make a spooky ghost costume, but they stole my shit. <laughs> they really did. I don't know. Um, wait for them to wander off and wreck their camp. Something that would make a teenage girl run home to mommy and daddy. <laughs> <laughs> I'll find them. All right. I, Thanks. I guess. But I'm going to need a race. <sighs> don't hold your breath. All right. I'd start by hiking back towards your tower and just keep an eye out for anything that would lead you to them. Okay. Oh, they're big into Red Eagle. <laughs> Great. Hmm? See if you can find the path they took down from there. Maybe they looped back around towards the lake or something. Okay. I doubt they're where they were yesterday, but they obviously can't have gone far. Hmm. Ah. Damn, they really just cut this? Like, who has the time? And the equipment? Like, oh my goodness. What are we doing? We're gonna head on down. I see you can. Head on down the path and pick up the trail. We gonna clean up. We gonna clean up. Is there another way there? Like, why would it just be like... Why would they just have this nice little path? And then just have you jump down? I guess just for options. They want options. There's variety. You never know, maybe you want to climb down and jump down, then get attacked by a mountain lion or something, where a dragon will fly from the sky and land here real quick. I don't know. Think of the Witcher or <laughs> Skyrim or something. <laughs> this is the right way. This is the right way. Looks like it. We're going the right way. Whee! Oh, long drop down. Looks like this is it. And I can't go back. Whee! Alright. 
Thurifer Basin to Forge Jonesy Lake. Um, this way? Maybe? Where am I? Where am I going? I don't see any cans. Supply drop. Ooh, 60 feet supply drop. Let's go. I need some supplies. Give me a machete. I gotta scare these girls. We need a machete. There's a big one. Is there a rifle in here? Ooh, we found the weapons. Weapons acquired. Just kidding, it's empty, Spruce. There is nothing in the supply. Hooray. Ooh, what's that? Hey, look at Mountain. It's Pride Rocket Simba. Me, 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 me. Oh, they got a bunch of trees just cut out over here for whatever reason. What's hmm. down here? Oh, death. We just have some designs over here, I guess. Hey, we just have some broken trees. Don't mind us. Don't mind it. Don't mind, don't mind. What's this? Delilah's Tower? Wait. I can see it? Oh, shoot. There it is. Do you see anything from yours? Like, you know, like clues as to where they could be? Ah, <laughs> clues. I really like your enthusiasm for mystery. I'm just doing my job. I like it. I, I do. I just... I, I can't wait for you to give these girls a piece of your... Our... Mind, minds, collective. <laughs> but no, no clues. I, I can't see anything from here. That's funny. Huh? What's this? What is going on here? Is this me like escaping later? Hey, I'm out at a ravine. What's this thing that spans across it? That is hmm? how you get to my sector. Oh. No kidding. Well, let me hike over. <laughs> well, it's locked up and mainly for emergencies. Oh. I've never actually used it. Rangers use it from time to time, but that's it. Oh. Huh. Help! Oh, God, it's an emergency! Oh, really? Yeah, I got, I got, um, I got eyes on a tornado! I gotta get out of here! It's a tornado. A tornado in the heart of the Rockies? Yes! Holy oh, moly, what's I need to call this in! Tom, Two Forks sees a tornado! He says he needs an evac into my sector. It's uh, a meteorological impossibility? There haven't been tornadoes in the greater Yellowstone region in a hundred million years? You're gonna need him to stay and take a detailed personal account, even if it means giving his life? Okay, I'll tell him. <laughs> Sorry, Hank. No dice. Dang. Man. She put the whole bit of scene in that line. Good for her. <laughs> Man. They're silly. I like it. It's very good banter. I appreciate the writing and the acting. Very good. Very nice. Very nice. Alright. We are lost again. Um, I guess this is not the way they went because I don't see any beer cans. So we're gonna hike back and see. I guess it's the other way. You'd think they'd put like a beer can on the sign or something to like hint what direction you need to go. But okay. We're just gonna go this way because it's the only other option. It was one or the other. One or two. That's a backpack. Is that their backpack? They got new backpacks? No wait, there's no way. Why would you leave and come back? It's a two day hike. What is this? There's an abandoned pack out here. And it's not one of the teens? Mm -mm. No, it looks like it was lost a long time ago. Well, you could always pilfer it for supplies. Pilfer. Ooh. Oh, Brian Goodwin. Okay. All right. Oh, jump scare. That's the second time he blinded himself in this game. What well, the heck? I am flush with ropes now. That pack was full of them. In decent condition, too. Nice. We love that's free lucky. rope. I mean, there's there's enough rope here that I could just leave them hooked up, I think. Well, that's convenient. Oh, get this. This uh, pack came with one of those cardboard single-use cameras. <laughs> with pictures left? Seems yeah, he only used three or four. Huh. Neato. What did I use this for? Thank you, Brian Goodwin. Wait, wait, who? The bag had the name Brian Goodwin sewn into the top. Do you know him? Yeah, I just haven't heard that name in a few years. What is the story of this? Ex lover. What was he a fella you had a thing with? <laughs> mm, yeah, it was so hot and heavy. Of course, Brian Goodwin was 12 years old, so, you know, our love. Oh, no. Really <laughs> Ugh. I'm kidding. <laughs> Not about him oh. being an actual 12 year old. That part's true. Oh. He was stationed in Two Forks, your lookout, with his dad, Ned, this three summers ago. Great kid. You can bring children out here? 
No. You know, I'm not a stickler for rules. They took off halfway through the summer. Oh, it does? Oh, there's only 18. That's cool. Um, Did you keep in touch? You guys keep in touch? You and the Goodwin kid? Nah. They took off pretty unceremoniously. Plus, what's a 40-year-old woman gonna do with a teenage pen pal? With a teenage pen pal? Good point. Hmm. Anyway, so it goes. Hmm. Have, uh, fun with that camera. Try not to snap anything that would scar a Photodome employee. Oh, of course. I don't know. I got a lot of hiking to do. Might get bored. Uh. Well, I'm bored as rocks, so I'll keep you company while you find those girls, huh? It's, I'm bored as rocks. <laughs> Alright. We're heading on down. I got a camera at my disposal. This is like a snake. Oh, look. It's a blue snake rope. We love ourselves a blue rope. Very nice. Very sturdy. Thank you. What's this? Thin what? What did it say? It said... Oh. Thin smoke? Oh, I see a really thin plume of smoke. It's probably them. Probably. Yeah, I see it too. A thin plume like this is either a new fire or a campfire. Hmm. Campfire. You think it's them? It's probably them. <sighs> I reckon so. I reckon so. It looks like it's to the southwest of me. I reckon so. That's right. If you hike towards Five Mile Creek, that should put you in the neighborhood. Keep an eye on that smoke plume. Let All right. Know if it's getting any larger. We got this. We'll do. Why the heck are they starting fires out here, bro? And drinking and smoking and drinking it. Yep. What are they for? What's in here? Give me something cool. I like the pretty flowers. That is very cool. Thank you. Oh, it's in a photo dome packet. So I guess it's the photo. Yep, yeah, Polaroids. Polaroid stuff. What's this? Hello? Dave! Guess who's going out with Debbie next week? No, not that shit heel Steve. It's your man Ron. I went up to check out the new guy at Two Forks. Heard him talking to himself, more than usual for LOs. So I figured I'd stay anyway. Remember remember when you saw Chimney Rock having himself in that hammock? I'm starting to think the Forest Service only picks the deranged and perverted. Except for us, of course. We're the creme de la creme. Let's toast to Deb at the spot. Ron. Okay. Okay. Loose stone. Fossilized claw. Uh, someone found a fossil and put it in a cash box. Hmm. Could be the same person who left that antler. Yeah, maybe they're leaving me an entire creature piece by piece. <laughs> What's this stone doing? Loose stone. Nothing? Alright, it, it was... It was very questionable. That's yeah, fine. Um, let's see. Where are we going? What's over there? Is that just like a lookout or something? What is this way? What are you? Is this the right way? Just so you know, I didn't mean to overstep my bounds earlier. Oh. When you brought up your wife. Oh. <clears throat> I know you didn't. You were just making conversation. Mm -hmm. I appreciate it. So, tell me about her, if you want. Um. Let's talk about her a little professor. bit. She's a PhD in biology, evolution, and stuff. Evolution. That's a risque subject in these parts. Hmm. Man, she sounds sexy. She sounds sure sexy. was. <laughs> Where does she teach? Yale. Yale? Yeah. Yep. A Yale. The Yale. Yale. Okay. Shit, Henry. <laughs> she flew back and forth. I hated it. Yeah, I would too. Not the yeah. Adlibs. Anyway, that's her. Hmm. Alright, let's head over to the fire that is blooming off in the distance. Oh, just kidding. We're gonna see what the heck this is about. We got fence? First a creepy cabin and now we got a fence? No, trespassing. Huh? Hello? Oh. Hello? Oh, oops. I think I have the camera out. My bad. My bad. Hey, uh, Delilah? I'm so confused. What do you got? You found him? Uh, no, not yet. Why would there be a fence out here? Yeah, what the heck? Uh, because sometimes hikers go ass over tea kettle when on a trail. So the Forest Service would put up a big chain link fence? A chain link fence? Mm -hmm. Yeah. It looks like it surrounds a huge area. We've got huh. mystery. That's weird. Who are they keeping out of here? And why? Ah, uh, jeez. I don't know. Maybe it's biologists, you know? Well, they don't want people traipsing on their precious lichens. 
What's, What's a lichen? lichen? Wouldn't you lichen to know? Oh my. Oh my god, goodbye. I'll ask next time I talk to someone, but <laughs> that'll probably be a few days. Oh, well. Do you think those girls could be behind this fence? Mm, well, having once been Damn, an ordinary a young woman, the last thing I would do is climb a fence. Mm. Especially if I knew I was in trouble. Yeah, I, I don't even know how I would get in. Mm. It's really strange that that's out there, by the way. Yeah. It's I weird. love that for me. I love mysteries that are scary and creepy. Did not agree. I, I signed up for Cozy Wholesome Time with hiking in the forest, not depression, dementia, questionable burnt cabin, mystery. Why is this place burnt down? What's happening? Why is this tree burnt and why is she not saying nothing about it? Talk to me. It's just the burnt tree. Okay, fine, whatever. Look how pretty this area is with the burnt tree. Lots of questions. Maybe, oh, well, actually, maybe it was just lightning. Maybe lightning struck it. That's fine. What's this? Supply drop. There was nothing there. There was nothing in the supply drop. Sucks. Unless maybe they'll... You know, if it makes you feel any better, you're a member of a diverse club of lookouts that have come to the thoroughfare after a breakup. There was Vernon, whose wife got put away for running cocaine. Becca, who was widowed after her husband, a jockey, was trampled by his horse. And Sharon, whose boyfriend had his own boyfriend. Oh. Maybe you boned the neighbor. Maybe she boned the neighbor. Maybe you both did. I don't judge. And if you ever want to talk breakups, I'm your gal. Okay, that jockey story is actually about you, huh? <laughs> <laughs> no. But can you believe that? It's That's crazy, crazy, right? Well, so then who? I'm the rare breed. My heart's intact. Oh. That doesn't mean I didn't join up to get away, but there's more to life than sex and romance. I, I don't think about anything I'm missing out here that I could be getting back there. Oh. And I recommend you try and do the same. Hmm. Okay. That's great. You should buy a lottery ticket when you get home. <laughs> Wyoming doesn't have the lottery. Oh. Well, come to Colorado. I'll take you to the res. <laughs> it's not luck. I just choose not to let a man dictate how my life goes. Ooh. Well, that's not normal. What? Whatever you say, Hank. What? She a strong, independent woman. You don't need no man, brother. You don't need no man. Also, there's, there's a lot of options for a conversation here. Oh my gosh, let me just fall into this or the hole. I'm having a hell of a time getting this fucking flapjack off his ass and out to repair that wire. What the? What? You want me to go back and see what I can do? No. I want this guy to have to roll his lazy ass all the way out here. It, flapjack is a choice phrase, flapjack. by the way. Flapjack? It really fits the bill in this case. <laughs> Oh, I can just jump down. Jump. Jump 50 feet. Jump 50 feet. You're not one of those guys who's building a great plan to get her back while you're out here, oh are you? Oh my gosh. Because you don't want to be that guy. I know everyone sees that guy in the movies and thinks, I can do that, I can get her back. But you should know, we hate that guy. If she broke up with you, she's already with someone else. I don't know if, if she... you broke up with her, she won't have you back if she's worth a damn. Yeah, but what do I know? Maybe you got to her in September and you've got twins by June. But it won't be because of your skills as a conversationalist. I'm not one of those guys. That's not what I'm doing. Oh, goodness. Phew. Well, that's a relief. <laughs> <laughs> Look, I might just be full of shit, you know? I had considered that. <laughs> Damn, she really be pushing, though. I feel like we're not at that point for him to just say something about it. So that's why I'm not mentioning my... My current wife. It sounds like a private matter, and I feel like I wouldn't talk about it immediately, unless she like really pissed me off, saying like you're really a bad man, a bad man, bad. You know what? You know what, woman? You'll find out in time. Also, this is a long rappel down. We. Whoa, whoa, where am I? Wow, I'm on top of a natural bridge out here. Oh, really? this one. Is it a complete arch? Uh, no, I guess the bridge is out here. Still, I think I could jump this gap to get across the canyon. Wow, well, you're a regular evil Knievel. Evil. Oh yeah, you should see the jumpsuit I'm wearing. Not the evil Knievel <laughs> reference. I would be scared to jump that too. I'd be like, uh, I don't know. I'm scared. Alright, we're going. We're climbing rocks now. 
Do, 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 do. Is, are they back at my camp? I feel like I missed the smoke. I, I don't know. I feel like I'm in the wrong direction. I feel like I missed it and I don't know what's going on. Also, what's with the music all of a sudden? I'm gonna go the right way. The only way is forward, so I'm assuming it's correct. Guess we'll find out. Oh, I can't clear it. How did I end up in the same place that I was getting lost in? Where am I supposed to go? Oh wait, I have more rope so I can actually go down. All right, guess we'll go down. Oh, okay, it's the same spot. Man, you had a full-on PhD at home. <laughs> part of me thinks that would be insufferable, but then there's another part of me that can't help but indulge the whole hot for teacher thing. Oh my! You know, heavy petting in the book stacks. Furtive glances during lecture. Oh, 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 office hours role play. But professor, I can't fail chemistry. This is funny. Isn't there I'm, anything I'm, I, I can don't know do if... to pass the class? Hmm. <laughs> oh god, I think the second part's winning. I don't know. Well, is this I called to ask about her, but now I think I've entertained myself plenty. Thanks. Look. Uh, there you go. She's actually really sick. I feel like this is the time to tell her. Very sick, and we couldn't be together anymore, and that's why I'm here. Oh, Let me just drop the bomb. Oh my god, I, I, I mean, I mean, fuck. What, what happened? We can talk about it later. I feel like I needed to drop the bomb. It was she was just kind of getting too too much. I feel like there there would come a point where you just be like, all right, okay. What does she have? Oh my. She's got Alzheimer's, like um dementia. Mm hmm. Whoa. How old was she? Is she? She's alive. She's with her family in Melbourne, Australia. She's 43. Fuck. Yeah. What was it like when you guys found out? Devastating. Especially for her. You can understand. And for you. Anyway, everything she worked for was taken away, and that was it. Yeah. I'm sorry to be such a downer. Don't, don't, don't even. I'm happy to listen. And, you know, we'll try to have some fun this summer. I promise. Oh. Okay. Well, you know. We meet again, Widowmaker. You haven't beat me yet. You ready to give it another shot? <laughs> Do I seriously have to? To get down to Five Mile Creek? Yeah, afraid so. It's quite a ways downhill from here. Uh. Hmm. All right. Yay! We love when ropes work. That, that is actually quite a long drop. I don't know how he didn't injure. All right, don't mind me floating. Um, I don't know how he didn't manage to injure himself going down there. Like actually injure himself. I'm assuming we're going this way. Probably. Probably. But wait, there's more. Do I want to go out there and check it out while I'm here? Oh damn, they really just circled the thing. Um, I'm literally right here. I'm gonna, we're gonna go. I know I've been going sidetracking this whole time, but like we're literally right here. So I might as well get it while I'm here. There it is. I found you. Spotted. Spotted dick. So, I am trying to open a box. Met in a bar. Mm, the birthplace of modern romance. This is really pretty right here, actually. I stumbled over and told her she was pretty, and that was it. <laughs> Aw, you were brave. I was drunk. I was drunk. <laughs> I was drunk. Ooh. Let's read it. Ron got some bad news back at home, so hopefully they'll let me out of here for a while. Who's to say, though? But just being what they are, 
Did you get my note about what went down in Wapiti? Sheriff isn't too pleased with me, but I don't know. I probably overdid it. Wish you would have been there, I guess. Uh, you must have got hung up. Dave. Hmm. Hmm. Hmm, what's going on with this? Copy the map. Literally says no fireworks and y'all shoot fireworks off. <laughs> Ooh, what's this? I found a sweatshirt from the University of Eastern Colorado. We got cans. What is Maybe this last of us? Girls? I mean, it's been here a long time. There's oh, a University of Eastern okay. Colorado? I really don't think there is. Why would somebody make that up? Right, and then put it on a sweatshirt. Okay. The world's okay. a weird place. Well, I wonder what that's about. I just want to know. What's, what do you mean? There's no such thing as that university. What do you mean? What the hell is this? What are you? What's on the floor? There's particles on the floor. Ah. Oh, get back on track. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's, let's go. Let's, oh, gosh. <laughs> Don't mind me struggling just to grab on a dang rope. Not the rope struggle. Ah. Oop. Okay, we got trauma climbing down these damn things. Okay, let's see what we're gonna have to do. What are you gonna do when the fire season wraps up? Are you gonna go be with her? Just go back to Boulder? You should go be with her. Uh, maybe I'll go visit. I don't know. Well, why not? She's with her family in Melbourne. They're not big fans of mine. Huh. Oh. Her sister, Susan, is great, but her parents, I, uh, think they always thought she could do better. Oh. And... That I could have done a better job looking after her. Hmm. Fuck that. I have no doubt you did your best. No. I don't know. If you want to go visit her, you should go. Don't let a couple of assholes keep you away from someone you love. I'll think about it. Yikes. Big yikes. Big yikes. Mm -mm -mm -mm. This is a big area. Big area. Ba -ba. Big. It's giving me long, long dark. Just warm. That game was both fun but scary at the same time because I'm, I wouldn't know what to do. I'd be so confused and lost in that game. I don't know, never, you never know. Maybe I'll play it one day. It could be wholesome, wholesome, cold, cold, some fun. What is this? How many hikers go missing in the Shoshone? More than none, unfortunately. Mitch Michael. With most of them being in this area, the thoroughfare because it's so remote. Why? I found an old flyer for a missing hiker. It just got me thinking, that's all. Like how you said one day you were talking to the Goodwins and then the next you weren't. Hmm. Ned Goodwin didn't get mauled by a bear or stuck in a ravine. He was just a PTSD day a-hole who dragged his son out to do a job and realized it was a bad idea. Bad. Grizzlies won't kill assholes? What, grizzlies won't kill an a-hole? They don't have a taste for unapologetic pricks? <laughs> nope. That's why we haven't lost a ranger in 11 years. Nice. So, you don't think anything bad happened to those guys? Yeah, I guess it's possible, but we usually find evidence of stuff like that. For instance, if you were to be hunted down and torn to shreds, I'm sure someone would come across a bloody beard and shredded pair of ugly cargo shorts. <laughs> I like these shorts. So what I'm sure you do, Henry. There's a photo here. There's a photo under this missing thing. Who is that? Also bears. Also pine cones. Anything else in here? Just a bunch of wood and pine cones. Oh, and the map. I didn't even do the map yet. Oops, my bad. <laughs> Alright, I think that's it for, for the supply cache. Cache! The cache! Okay, we almost there. We gotta find the camp. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. There we go. Into the woods we go. We are out here. Boy, for as dry as it is this summer, there's an area down here that's uh, lush. Yeah. Oh, you must be talking about the Aspen Grove down there. It's pretty. Yeah, I think that's where I am. Those trees are actually one root organism. Did you know that? Oh, that's cool. I didn't. Yeah, they share their water as a colony that can live for hundreds of years, even through fire. Oh. Can you believe you're actually getting paid to learn all of these amazing things? Hmm. <laughs> Also, uh, by what it looks like on this map, you'll be coming up on a stream that should lead you towards where we saw that smoke. Oh, good. Nice. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, that way. 
Run away. All right. Just follow the water. Follow the water. Let me not walk in the water. I don't want wet socks. That socks. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Mm. Yo, it's weird we haven't seen any like wildlife out here. Just birds. What's that? What's this? Music. Music's swelling up. But do I? Up here? Nope, not up here. What is that? It's a really nice waterfall down here. Given those girls love a skinny dipping, I bet they're nearby. <laughs> I bet they're nearby. Let's see. Oh, there's a little dead end here. There's gotta be something here. Hey, what's to the south of here? Um, Mexico? Mexico. Is this some sort of riddle? I just have a nice view to the south. You know, trees and mountains forever. Well, eventually you wander into the area overseen by Chimney Rock Lookout, hmm. but that's probably an impossible hike in terms of terrain. Oh. We got Vista. Alright, let's, uh... Let's figure out what we're gonna do these girls. Teach them a lesson. Um, do I have to like sneak or something? Or what are we doing? There's a towel here. Scarf. Something. What is this? What is this? Scrap off fabric. Uh, there's some cloth out here. It looks like it was torn from something. Strange. I'll keep looking around. Can I take it? It's kind of floating right now. No? Okay. Alright. This is, this is a pretty little waterfall. Yeah, he was a lion. I was like, wow, so small, but it's it's pretty. Anything here? No? Okay. Nothing here. It's over here. Ah. Ooh, this would be a nice little shelter. It'd probably be very cold at night. Oh, found them. We found them. We found their camp. Let's go. I see a campsite, and it looks like they've got a fire. Is it them? No, it seems like it. I swear, they must have dragged four cases of beer out here. How do they carry Track all that? Them down and don't let them see don't you. Don't let them see what you. What a job this is. Don't let them see you. I'm scared. I feel like I should save, but it's fine. It's fine. These girls have a full case of beer left here. A full case. That's a lot. Well, they're impressive little shits, I guess. That oh, is my some sheets. dedication. Ah, found my sheets. My sheets. So they did break into your tower. Looks like. Oh, gosh. Those are my sheets. I have entered the teen zone. <laughs> oh, really? And where's that? It's the name of a magazine for girls. It's <laughs> on the ground here at their camp. The teen zone. Huh. Pants are back. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Pants are back. <laughs> well, according to the experts at Teen Zone magazine, it's unclear where they've been. Uh, the pants, I mean. <laughs> well, I found some dangerous hunks. Name what? Tame your On hunk. Earth, are you? It's another one of those magazines. With your top hunk tits. Hunks, hunks, hunks. I don't get why the hunks have to be so dangerous. <laughs> well, you're clearly not a young woman. Girls should want nice hunks. Nice hunks? Ugh, boring. Not the boring hunk. Alright, what the hell is this? Is, it, is this a tent? I was like, are they gonna see me? Where are they? Uh, some of their clothes are all torn up. Uh, that's, that's not, not good. good. Oh, now it's maybe getting creepier. Take one of their sleeping bags as payback. At this stage, take whatever you want. <laughs> What the heck's going on? The tent looks like it's been through the shredder. That's which would explain crazy. that scrap I found. What could have done that? Like a like a bear or um. Hmm. I don't know. It sounds crazy, but even a bull elk, if it's off its rocker, there's whatever no, did oh, it no. did not hold back. You've got that camera, right? It might be a good idea to get a few snaps, just in case. Yeah, good thinking. All right. What if I had no more photos? What if I didn't have any photos? Oh, I just wasted it all. I'd probably be like, uh, 
Can I take this? Nope. Alright, I guess we're gonna read the note. Oh, it looks like someone left a note. Intriguing. Maybe you should read it. Okay. Yeah. Let me know what it says. Hmm. Oh, they're gone for sure. Well, what's it say? Threatening to call the police because they think I attacked them. Oh my god, well, <laughs> did you? No. No, well, hey, I didn't do this. Okay, someone or something went to town here, but it wasn't me. Because I told you to scare them, hmm. not assault them. Yeah, I took their whiskey back at the lake, but that just felt like, I don't know, the cost of doing business. <laughs> That's different, okay? And I don't blame you. <laughs> it's, it's, I don't know, weird as hell, but it wasn't me. It's, it's okay, I believe you. Hmm. Weird stuff happens in the woods. It could be other campers, they could be having a bad mushroom trip, we really don't what? know. But they're gone. There's no way to call the cops, okay. they're not coming back, and we can get to work. I'd really like to start enjoying a quiet summer. Huh. Yeah, me too. Hmm. Oh, okay. Day three. Oof, jump scare. I didn't even have to go back to the tower. Okay. That was day three. Jeez, okay. Oh, I'm fixing. <laughs> Gotta patch the window up. Huh. Oh, that's cool. I like how they changed it up. Each day is slightly different. Huh. Did he- Hey, Henry? Well, hello? Yeah. Um, what do you look like? Why are you asking? Yeah, what the- Because I'm horribly superficial. <laughs> Rolly fingers? Burt well, Reynolds. I get confused for Burt Reynolds all the time. Oh, is that so? <laughs> Women say that we have a similar musk. Wow. Uh-huh. Hey, you asked. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, that gives me a good start. Now let's see. In my scope, I can only tell you're a white guy wearing shorts. That's crazy. It's hot. And maybe, by the way, I'm not white. It's not very, uh, you know, PC Peace. or whatever they say. <laughs> oh my god, you are the whitest man. Wow. I don't need a spotting <laughs> scope for that. And if not shorts, then what do you normally like to wear? Uh, clothes, um, it's just clothes. I feel like he's just a guy that wears clothes. Clothes. I don't really think about it. Oh, come on. I got a sweatshirt I like. Good jacket I got at the Buckle Barn. Buckle Barn. Ooh, I love the Buckle Barn. Just one of those brown ones, you know? I do. Now tell me about your face. I'm looking I at thought you we were going to end. Oh my gosh. What do I see? Uh... <laughs> Thin mustache and long scar. A <laughs> uh, pretty thick beard. Oh, have you always had a beard? For a while, yeah. All right, perfect. <laughs> perfect. I want to know about your eyes. Get out of here. Get out of here. I'm drawing here. you. I need to know. Oh, she draws. Your what? Is is that okay? Uh. <laughs> don't don't answer. I'm gonna do it regardless. Oh. Fine. Your eyes. Tell me. Steely. Happy, tired. We'll do steely. They're, uh, they're steely. A cold, hard stare. <laughs> like husky. Like a Siberian husky. Not a husky. <laughs> uh, sure. <laughs> okay, got it. Thank you, Henry. Okay. You get what you need? Absolutely. Alright, well, uh, the color of the area change. It's more of like a blue you now and uh ooh, trees hey um baby um but yeah now it's like a nice blue calm hue which is really cool i like the change in scenery from the orange and the hotness to now cool weather i don't know what they're gonna do for this day they didn't basically right now we're fixing the window and i'm sure something's gonna happen when i go downstairs but we're gonna find out next time don't know what or whom attacked the girls the um the hooligans that supposedly broke into my Play. Oh, I mean, they had my my um my blankets and stuff, so they definitely did that. Uh, I don't know who destroyed their camp and all that. So, the mystery continues. Anyways, looking forward to the next one to see what this what the how the mystery unfolds. What's with the questionable burnt cabin in the woods randomly, and the relationship between Ron and Dave? I guess the names. And then why is Delilah drawing me? Which is reminding me of Hank's Hank Henry's wife. I call him Hank. Henry's wife. Um, we're slowly revealing each other's past. 
We don't know very much about Delilah though, which is which is bothering me. I don't know why she's prying so much, but I guess that's just that our character doesn't pry. She's just like interested to get to know us, and he's just like, I'm just here for a good different time. So I don't know. We'll see. We'll find out next episode. Thank you for watching. It's a me, Mar. Appreciate everything. Appreciate you guys watching. Comment, subscribe. If you enjoy the comment, uh, if you enjoy the content, please like, subscribe, comment. What do you think is going to happen next? If you played it, am I going the right way? Is this okay? Is this normal? Am I doing it right? I don't know. I haven't played games in a while, so I'm figuring it out. But I appreciate it. Thank you for watching. Thank you for getting this far if you're at this point. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.